Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello, my name is Brielle. If you aren't new here, welcome back, as I already stated. As you can see by the title of today's video, we are doing a 2021 summer swimsuit try-on haul. Before you click off this video after the information I'm about to tell you, all these pieces are regular swimsuits, but they're bump friendly options. I am 30 weeks pregnant, which means I only have 10 weeks left to pregnancy. In month terms, that's like seven and a half, eight months pregnant. None of these are maternity pieces. They're all bump friendly. So you can get them in your size, whether you are pregnant or not. So for me, I normally wear an extra small, small in swimsuits, and all of these I sized up to either a medium or a large. Let's be honest, swimsuits are freaking expensive. I can't get myself to spend over $100 on a swimsuit. So this first swimsuit is actually a dupe for the You Swim Eva swimsuit. Um, it is a one-piece swimsuit. It is a one-size-fits-all but it actually, unlike Brandy Melville and brands that do one size fits all, um, it actually is like a universal piece that a ton of different body styles and types can wear. And I think that's why this brand is so popular. Like I said, it's one of those brands where the swimsuits are over $100 and I just can't get myself to buy them. This swimsuit is from ASOS and it's almost identical to the sage color that they have on their website from You Swim. This pattern is super in this summer, whether it's a one piece or two piece. I don't really know what to call it. It actually is extremely comfortable, super stretchy, and works perfectly with the bump. I've been wearing this all the time. It dries really quickly, and it's one that I'll be able to wear pregnant and not pregnant. So that was a big key selling point for me. Only 37 bucks, a great dupe for that You Swim, and I highly suggest it. I don't think I mentioned this before, but I will link all these swimsuits down below. Swimsuit number two is from Aerie. I did pick this up when they were having a sale. So they run sales a lot on their swimsuits. Most of the time it's like 20 a piece per swimsuit. Um, so meaning like $20 for the top, $20 for the bottom. This is a little cheeky and it shows quite a lot of skin. I don't know what it is, but I feel more confident about my body when I have a bump. Maybe it's because you don't have like flubbiness going on because everything's tight. Does that make any sense? Probably not. And I feel super confident and super comfortable in this top here. So it is a ribbed material. It has a ton of support for my growing, you know, and it is longer. It's kind of like a cropped tank. And then these bottoms. When I bought them online, I didn't realize how cheeky and exposed I was gonna be. I'm not monetized yet. I am so close. Um, but I feel like I'm not good to monetize for showing you guys this, but I'm just gonna show you anyways. So this is the front, and this is the back. I feel like black is a great color. You can play it up with some jewelry or some accessories, pops of color, a headscarf, whatever you wanna do. I have been loving this swimsuit this summer, so this is definitely one I would suggest. So this next swimsuit is actually from Target. I wanted to do a brighter pop of color, so this is, it's a mix between red and coral. I'm gonna be wearing this this weekend. Uh, it's 4th of July weekend this weekend. I'm really excited to wear this on the boat, swimming at the beach, all that jazz. This one is just from Target's Exhilaration brand and it was $29.99. What I liked about this one and what's really flattering when you are pregnant um, is the cinching on the side and then it is open on the back. I do like that it covers a lot more booty so it's a little more family friendly, beach friendly, all that jazz. All that jazz. So this is another ribbed material. I'm obsessed with ribbed swimsuits lately and a great option that's super affordable and available at your local Target. And then the last swimsuit is also from Target. This is a bikini number. So what I love about this one is it's not see-through. So you've got your regular ribbed material on the outside. And then you've got another layer of protection because that's the one thing about white swimsuits and issues I've had in the past is it being see-through. And that's just the worst because I adore the look of white swimsuits. Again, a little cheeky, but not, not as bad as the black swimsuit. So this specific swimsuit, when I picked it out, is because it does have 
cups in it. So it's gonna give me a lot more protection than a regular basic bandeau swimsuit. And I like that it had the adjustable straps on top. You can really control how much support you are getting as well. And then it has multiple loops for tightness in the back. So this is a 34C in the top and then the bottoms I got in a medium. And this is from their Shade and Shore. I'm pretty sure that this is a new line at Target this year. So it is a little more expensive. It was $30 for the top and $17.99 for the bottoms. I think it's just higher quality swimsuits than the Exhilaration or any other brands that Target carries. So higher quality, higher prices, just makes sense. So that is it for today's video. Like I said, I'll be sure to link all these swimsuits down below. I know they are very basic swimsuits and there are so many fun 70s styles and patterns this summer that are really trendy. So if you have a personal swimsuit that you're obsessed with, comment it down below a link. So our feller, feller. <laughs> fellow watchers, if they're looking for more bold or trendy styles, they can check out what you're wearing this summer. Thank you so much for watching this video. Like I said, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. I post new videos every Saturday. I hope you guys have a blessed week. And just a little spoiler alert, we do have a 1.5K giveaway coming. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>